Alright, here we go again with the Roland MV8800. Previous video I showed you how to import samples. Now I'm going to show you real quick once you import them how to name it and uh, save it to your hard drive. So, uh, a quick tip if you're importing a bunch of samples, it's best to start from a blank project. So, if you want to create a new project, you uh, hit the project button and then you would select. Uh, uh, create new project which is number six so you have like a like a like an empty house and then you once you load all your samples in name them and save them it's a lot easier to keep them organized so this is a quick tip so go back here I imported some samples I imported some some uh, organs real quick, little loops there. I did them to part number five. It just says a knit patch because I haven't given a name yet. So if you want to name the uh, the patch that you're creating, you hit menu right here. Select number one patch name. Just hit select that or either hit the enter button. Here you give it a name. So all you got to do is uh, turn the dial. I'm just going to change a couple letters. Um, make it real simple here. Uh, called Oregon. I call it Oregon Patch. So once I give it a name, I just hit OK under F5, and name now appears where I assign it as my initial patch. And now say I want to save it to the hard drive. So what I want to do is uh, hit the menu button again, select number two, cursor down, save patch. Select that where I want to save it. Most likely either you created a folder or you can go into your original patches folder. So you cursor down to patches. You have all your different categories here. Let me see if I have anything. Um, I'll put it in the, in, once I select the folder I want to go into, I open it up. And then all I have to do is hit F5 save, and uh, you know, you see the name of it and everything. Just hit execute again on F5. So now when I turn off the machine and turn it back on, I can just go to that particular folder when I want to load that patch, and everything will be there. So again, real simple. Once you import your samples, you want to name them. If you want to name them, just hit the menu button, select patch name, give it a name. Then uh, once you give it a name, under the menu again, you go to save patch number two. You select that. Select the folder. You know, you go into the folder that you want to go into. I'm going into my key folder, keyboard folder on the patches. And that's pretty much it. So again, uh, real basic, import your sample, give it a name, save it to the hard drive. And again, like I said, the tip earlier, if you're doing a bunch of samples, it's best to do it from a blank project so it keeps you organized and you know it makes it the, the transition a lot easier and a lot smoother. So there we go again with the Roland MV8800 uh, and after importing a sample, uh, giving it a name and saving it to the hard drive. All right, have a good day now. Bye.